Hi there. Today's tutorial covers the latest update of the Windows operating system, which is Windows 11. The update was formally introduced last month, and the first preview build of Windows 11 was also released to the Windows Insider community. That means Windows 11 is being tested across diverse systems before making it available on the market. The big question now is, can your computer run Windows 11? This video also shows how to check if your computer meets all the requirements by using the compatibility checker tool. Without further ado, let's get started. Open an internet browser. Copy and paste the link in the address bar. The link will take you to the GitHub repository. The name of the checker tool is Why Not Win 11. This is what the tool looks like after you install it. You can hover down for more information. Let's now download the app. As you notice, there are already more than 20 releases of this app. Please download only the latest one. Take note, download only either of these two. This one is for a 64-bit operating system, while this one is for a 32-bit operating system. To find out your computer's system type, right-click on the Windows logo. Choose System. This is where you can find it. If it is 64-bit, then download this file. After downloading, open the file and run it. These are the results after checking my computer. It is obvious that a lot of things I need to upgrade. This icon shows a description of each requirement. Please take note of this. The results are based on currently known requirements. This means these requirements might be changed when the Windows 11 Insider program is finished. Having said that, always check for any new release of this compatibility checker tool on GitHub. If you are wondering about the reasons for these new requirements, Microsoft explains these three main reasons. Then, the next question is, what now if my computer does not meet the requirements? Well, you still have a few more years to continue using Windows 10. Windows 11 is expected to roll out by October this year, and it's a free upgrade for all licensed Windows 10 users. Alright, I hope that you got all the requirements green after checking your computer. In my case, the best option is to buy a new computer. So, what are your thoughts on these Windows 11 requirements? Just leave a comment below. That's all for this tutorial. Thanks for watching. If you find this video informative, please subscribe, like, and share it with your friends.